Hey guys! Um, so I had zero intentions of filming today, hence hashtag slob life. Um, I look like poo poo, but I want to record or upload a video once a week, and I had some issues with my last video, so I had to take it down, which is no big deal. Um, I just had to take it down. So I don't want to go like three weeks without a video because my next video I have planned is, um, I think, let's see, one, two, three, four fancy meals you can make at home to like, for like date night or something like that. Um, but obviously I am making them four different days. So it's going to take me kind of a long time to um, make this video. So uh, I'm going to make that all this week, and then that video will be up next week. But I didn't want to go um, like a whole two weeks without posting a video. So I just decided to get on here really quick and um, do another grocery haul because, I mean, they're easy videos to do, and I grocery shop. Hold on, I'm going to fix this real quick. Oh, I hope that's, it looks like it's not um, centered. But anyways, they're easy to do and um, kind of give you guys like an out or a look into our life and what we buy weekly. And and I found out, guys, that I can't take my daughter shopping with me anymore because she's getting to the age where she like can pick out things. So I bought like 10 things. Well, not 10 things. That's exaggerating. But I bought a couple things that I was not planning on buying because she saw them in the store and asked for them, so I spoil her, so I couldn't say no. But anyways, I'm going to do this a little different today. I'm just going to kind of hold the camera and show you guys what I buy instead of me being in front of the camera. So let's get started. Okay, so first off, um, th these are my not happy I buy items. <laughs> um, like I said, my child is super picky. So um, I just basically get whatever she will freaking eat because it's impossible to get her to eat things. So um, she likes these and my husband also eats these for his lunch. So um, we j I just bought one for his lunch because she ate one um, this weekend and then one for her. So these are just the Jack's frozen pizzas. I got a cheese one and a Canadian bacon. And then um, I got the nut thins for me and my cheese that I always eat, but they didn't have like any flavor. So this is just the original brand. I mean, they're okay, but I like the flavored ones. Um, uh, this is one of the items Scarlett picked out. <laughs> Hot cocoa and marshmallow um, donuts, and she calls these donies. <laughs> and this is the other one she picked out, just some colored goldfish. And then um, for easy lunches for both me and her, um, I am a child at heart and macaroni and cheese is one of my favorite things. So I have the gluten-free one for me. And then um, a couple of crafts for Scarlett. Um, I was out of my coffee, so I restocked on my Starbucks um, blonde roast. And then we needed more butter, so I got butter, you know, really staple things um okay so one of the meals i am making for um like the five uh like date night meals is a homemade caesar salad um chicken caesar salad and i'm gonna make a caesar salad from scratch so i have romaine hearts for the caesar salad um milk for scarlet milk milk i say milk my mom gave me that lovely um, pronunciation because she says it too but it's milk <laughs> um, asparagus because I bought um, a prime rib that was on sale for $5.99 a pound so I bought a half of a roast so I'm going to um, cook my roast and serve it with um, asparagus and roasted garlic mashed potatoes um, I have some herbs just some rosemary and thyme that I'm going to put um, on my prime rib that I'm doing. Um, flat leaf parsley for I, I'm doing a pasta dish and a risotto so I have that. Um, I drink these, I stopped drinking these a while ago but um, we were out of drinks so my husband bought me these um, at the gas station one time. 
and I was kind of back addicted to them. So um, these are like my ride or die drinks, Lipton green teas. I am obsessed with them and I kind of got back into them. So we bought one of those. Um, mushrooms for the risotto and I might serve this like on the side with the prime rib if I have enough. Uh, one of Scarlett's um, staples is chicken and cheese taquitos. Um, she can eat these literally for lunch and dinner. She's obsessed with them. We go through probably one of these size boxes maybe once every week and a half. Um, Walmart was kind of running low on um, onions, so I usually just get white onions, but um, they didn't have any. So I had, I got the sweet Vidalia onions. I just always buy onions basically because onions basically are my biggest staple. And then for my, um, homemade Caesar dressing. I have anchovies. Um, I don't know if this is going to be enough. I might have needed more. I don't know yet. So, And then I have Parmesan already, but I have like four dishes that are going to have Parmesan in it. So I figured just in case I run out, I would get another block of Parmesan. And then uh, whipping cream, which again, I have one in the fridge, but I thought I was going to run out. So I bought another one just in case. And look at me, I bought organic. Ooh, check that out, people. Um, but to be honest, it was the only one they had, so. <laughs> um, and then I just wanted to try this because it looked really good. It's just like a frozen meal, but um, I figured I can do it for like a lunch. I love pork carnitas, so I thought I'd try like this frozen one. And it's got um, tomatillo garlic salsa fajita vegetables pinto beans over cilantro rice and then that has guacamole so it's kind of really yummy sounding so i just wanted to try it it's just like the sam's brand and then um, a bag of potatoes i still have some potatoes um, but i'm gonna use them up um, and then i'll i just always have potatoes in the house because it's an easy side so yeah that is basically it um like i said i'm gonna make so I'm going to post the next video. So this one will go up probably today because it's super short. So it won't take me long to edit. Um, but um, tonight I'm making one of the dishes. And then Thursday I'm making another one. And then maybe Sunday, Saturday, I'll be making the fourth one. Fifth one. I need five. Oh gosh, I have five meals. Um, so basically, so my next video is um, five date night meals that you can make at home. And so the first one I'm making is a balsamic um, creamy uh, pasta with uh, clams, or not clams, sorry. Yeah, clams. Clams and sun-dried tomatoes. It sounds weird, but it's delicious. Um, the second one is I'm making a prime rib with the roasted garlic, mashed potatoes, and asparagus. Um, the third one is a basically clean out my freezer um, risotto. So I'm going to use the leftover prime rib that I had. Uh, I have some lobster tails in the freezer, some leftover scallops, and some shrimp. And they're all going to go into risotto. And this sounds fancy, guys, but I buy things on sale. So that's all items that I bought on sale or I'm using up. And then, um, then the next one is the chicken Caesar salad. So maybe it is four. I can't count, guys. Pasta. Yeah. So there's four of them. So that'll be up probably Monday, Tuesday, depending on when I get everything done. And yeah, so that's basically it. Um, like always, uh, click the subscribe button down below if you want to see more of these kind of videos. Push the like button. And yeah, we'll see you guys soon. Bye, guys.